Okay, I have talked to Little Cactus several times. Now, uh, you do have to leave every time uh, you want a new story written. I don't believe we have seen Fight at the Airship yet. Cutie's getting bished and bashed by bad guys using magic. It makes my prickers stand on end when hearing news so tragic. Bashed and end. Whatever. Okay, uh, that is it for the plot-related ones, as you can see there. Quite a few more plot-related ones before we start getting to the side quests. We have much more plot to take care of just yet. Uh, we also have Shiny Knight 2. We have that glittering guy again, but me, I'm getting furious. We're not some silly errand boys with a delivery. Servius. That, that worked out well. We also have Chatty Guy. Got stuck with some old chatty guy who rambles on for years, but such a fate is remedied by tissue in the ears. <laughs> oh, just don't listen to him, apparently, and that's all that we have uh, from him. Now, I don't think I planted anything, uh, but as you can see, it's kind of a uh, wood day. I, w I would say that that looks like wood to me. So let's go ahead and talk to Trent. And I do believe that on this day, because it does depend on what day and what seeds you use, what day you plant and what seeds you use. So I'm going to go with crooked seeds and small seeds. And I think that's going to get me what I would like to get the most. Just a hunch, though. Just a hunch. All right. Uh, nothing that I really want to temper or forge just yet. So let's head out of here. We need to head west. And west here, we do get a treasure chest with a magic walnut in it. Very nice. And uh, imps. Ah, <laughs> one-shotted. <laughs> if I can kill these in, in two shots, I'm going to. Two. Two. Very nice. And then this guy takes three, unfortunately. Now, I don't think I want to move on just yet, because obviously there is something up there. I don't believe there's actually a pass south out of here, but I was starting... Oh, there is a pass uh, south of here. So, I don't believe there's anything here for us, though. There's just the cannon. And I can't jump up here? No. Figured. It's supposed to be too high, although they don't show it off very well. We cannot use the cannons just yet, but don't worry, their time will come. Their time will definitely come. Let's head south here, and here we can grab ourselves a chocolate lump. No, I don't believe I can make these jumps. Uh, yeah, I can't attack anything from here either. Back in the prickly desert up here. We need to head around. Let's just avoid all these enemies this time. And just head south out of here because that's the only way I can go. Now we can start heading up here. Just take on these guys. Ugh, get critical hits. It's freely appreciated. All right, we can grab this treasure chest here. Grab ourselves a flat seed. Very nice. And though they aren't exactly what I'm looking for, I will take it. And then we can head up north here, and that's how you get this treasure chest. Oh, wait. I see one hidden there that I didn't see before. chock a lump in this one, though. So now we need to head south to this screen again. I want off. The jump mechanic is not being very nice to me today. I have to be in a perfect position for it. But if we check over here behind the tree, we can see a treasure chest with a gummy frog in it. Very nice indeed. So let's head south through here. And we can continue to take on these guys. These freaking rabbis. Oh, critical hit. Very, very nice. Sorry, the, the rebellions. They're technically upgraded rabbites. But still, I like to think of them as rabbis. There's no other way for me to go, so let's just head south out of here. Now it is Salamander Day. Uh-oh. This doesn't look good at all. Let me use this. Okay, I think we are ready to head south here. These, these things look like they should be lit up, but they are not. They're probably lit up at night. And we have made it to the town of Jod. What is up? We have a lot to do in this town, as you might imagine. Siblings and families shouldn't live apart. At least that's what Mr. Devious says, but I think that's kind of idealistic. 
Now we do have quite a few quests to do here. On top of the ones that we're already doing, we have five new side quests to do in this town. This is going to be Side Quest City today, apparently. I saw a woman looking out the window over at Devious Manor. She was pretty and holding the loot. Who could she be? I wonder if we need to give her a rhino loot. Minstrels often come by our town. Lester is the best of the bunch, but he's been sucked in by Devious too. What a predicament! People here all seem to want to talk about Devious. I don't get it. Endless. It goes on forever. What's going on? Huh? You look like some kind of adventurer. Could you help me decipher this ancient mystery? Yes, I could! People of old passed on some good advice. Keep your will steely past the desert freely. Sorcerer who stopped the flow of the great sand river wrote it. Anyway, I'll read it. Sand flows in an endless cascade, ordering our endless steps. When a pair of trees you find, try keeping this advice in mind. To stop the sand and see the gate, walk round these trees of figure eight. Can you figure it out? What do you mean, figure it out? You pretty much just told me what I needed to do. There's no problem solving there. You just do that. All right, so we have a few places to go. Now, if I remember right, and chances are I do not, we need to head to Devious's Manor first, which I believe is over to the west here. It definitely looks like it could be Devious's Manor. That's where the birds went. The birds. Yes, they are probably the birds that we set free in window. They seem to be doing pretty well. That does sound good. Let's head in here. And we have found Devious Manor, and here we are in search of Priscilla. Priscilla in particular. Can I jump through here? I can. Very nice. Let's grab this treasure chest because it's here. Give me the gumdrop. Can I jump this way? You can jump out through here. This is Devious Manor. Thank you. Thank you very much. He is not home. That is too bad. That is too bad. Can I jump? This way. This way. Come on, let me over. I want what's in there. I know. You'll let me get it eventually. Uh, right. And to the north connects to the clock tower. Sounds like we'll be doing a lot of stuff here. Priscilla, you're kidding. From Grandma? From me? It's totally awesome. Rattlelope is my all-time favorite. No. You were like so totally bogus. That is the wrong person. Don't give it to the wrong person. You will fail the quest. You have to give it to Priscilla, not Priscilla. I've never even heard of Priscilla in my life. What kind of name is that? It's crap. That's what that is. Uh, let's see. Primera? This? For me? It's okay, take it. Your mind is it really for me? No. No, it is not. Spoil sport! Of course I am. What else would I be? Alright, let's head uh, south through here because that's probably going to lead me to another treasure chest that I couldn't get to. Oh, it's going to lead me upstairs, actually. Which is pretty much where I wanted to go anyway. It does lead me to a treasure chest eventually, with an elephant tusk in it. Uh, yeah, another elephant tusk, it's one of those raw materials. Okay, let's head up here on the second floor. We see the birds. Very nice. Precio! Get me closer and I'll pop you one. No. What? So she said the same thing? What the hell? Alright, give me a Luna icon. That is definitely new. I don't even know where that would go. Um, it's not going that item, is it? No. It's not seeds, not fruits, not veggies. It can't be... No, it's not raw materials. I don't think so. It's a... No, it's not here. Mystery items? No. It's not meat. I did pick up a new meat, though, I think. Uh, that would be... No, I did not pick up a new meat. I thought I did. Uh, it's not recovery. No, we were there already. Where the hell did this item go? Luna icon? Maybe it's an accessory? Accessories? 
No, those are all earrings. I will have to find that later, because apparently it's not here. Priscilla, Bridget! We're wicked busy, so stay out of the way, huh? No. No, not for you. Freaking Bridget. But he's so great. A scrumptious looking rhino. Could I have some? Yes, you can, Priscilla. Is this from. It is from Grandma. This is so weird. I mean, my birthday is like today. I know. Would you give her this peach puppy? Peach puppy? She totally loves them, and we've received a peach puppy. You know, when we're apart, my grandmother always thinks of me, and I have uh, completed the quest partially. Uh, let's take a look at uh, that. Oh, is it Peach Puppy? It's a fruit then, right? Peach Puppy! I don't know what kind of puppy that's supposed to be, but I don't I don't really see it. If it's a puppy, it's one ugly-ass puppy. How you doing, Bertie? Very nice. Alright, let's grab the treasure chest here. And here we can get a moon coin! Another trait coin! A new one for me. Uh, unfortunately, I can't even look at it right now because we're not in a battle. Hooray. Okay, so that is, uh, well, enough in devious manner, I think. Enough for now. Let's head back out to town, because there is definitely some more things that I need to do out there. And we can take care of plot some other time. Right now we have side questing to do. Let's go back to the town of Jod. Let's just start going into random people's houses. How you doing? Beautiful song can dispel evil mist. Remember that. Okay. Seems Amanda doesn't like music much. I understand Amanda's feelings all too well. All minstrels do is waste their breath singing. What good does that do? You know what they are? The philosophers of our generation. Don't you agree? Yes! I like music. Who doesn't like music? Healing to the soul. Ah, crap. Are we doing this all again? Ah, oh, jeez. What if I say no? Music sucks. Who hates music? Don't get it, do ya? That's why. You're from the boonies, right? Don't people from the boonies actually have, like, more music? Whatever. It's very Middle Eastern around here. Very Middle Eastern indeed. Uh, let's head in here next. Into the inn. There's always good people at the inn. I'm a supremely talented pharmacist. It's Clive again. If you collect a few things like honey and honey onions and also some dice berries, I'll make a honey elixir that'll build up your strength. <laughs> I have none of those. Not a single one. Count Devious has fallen for Amanda. He can do better. There's a path behind the sand cascade, but no one knows how to stop the sand. I do. He told me the secret, which was just do something exactly the way that I said it. Okay, that I can do. It looks like that's it for the inn. So let's head... I was going to head up here. They are going to let me. Hooray. So let's head up here. I do believe this is a shop. No, it's actually somebody's house, it looks like. Are you? I heard there were some rebel soldiers. Look like I, this might be... Oh, nothing. Just talking to myself. Don't mind me. All right. Would you consider doing me a favor? Would you give this to Kurt and Minos? And we have accepted Courtney's letter without really saying yes or no. Um, yeah, we're going to have to go back to Minos a few times for this. My dad said that he fell into quicksand when he was a kid. He said he walked through a big space under the sand, but nobody believes him. My dad's not always good with details.